Hey, what's up you guys? It's Dorothy and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are going to go into poems 65 through 68 of Where the Sidewalk Ends by Shel Silverstein. So let's get right into this video. 65, the toucan. Tell me who can catch a toucan. Lou can. Just how he, how few can ride the toucan. Toucan. What kind of goo can stick you to the toucan. Glue can. Who can write some more about the toucan. You can. 66. The planet of Mars. On the planet of Mars they have clothes just like ours and they have the same shoes and same laces and they have the same charms and same graces and they have the same heads and same faces but not in the very same places. 67. Love. Ricky was ill but he's home with the flu. Lizzie w R O had some homework to do. Mitchell E probably got lost on the way so I'm all of love that could make it today. 68. The dirtiest man in the world. Oh, I'm the oh, I'm dirty Dan, the world's dirtiest man. I've never taken a shower. I can't see my shirt. It's so covered with dirt. My ears have enough to grow flowers. But the water is either a little too hot or else a little too cold. I'm musty and dusty and patchy and scratchy and mangy and covered with mold. But the water is always a little too hot or else a little too cold. I live in a pen with five hogs and hen and three squeezy lizards who creep in my bed. And they itch as I squirm as I twitch in the cruddly, cruddy old sheets that I sleep in. If you look down my throat with a flashlight, you note that my insides are coated with rust. I creak when I walk, I squeak when I talk, and each time I sneeze, I blow dust. The thought of a towel and some soap makes me howl. And when people have something to tell me, they don't come and tell it. They stand back and yell it. I think they're afraid they might smell me. The bed bugs that leap off me sing to sing me to sleep, and the garbage flies buzz me awake. They're the best friends I've found, and I fear they might drown, so I never go near a lake. Each evening at nine, I sit down to dine with the termites who live in my chair, and I joke that the bats and I have with the bats and have intimate chats with the cooties who crawl through my hair. I'd brighten my life if I just found a wife, but I fear that I will that will never be until I can find a girl gentle and kind with a beautiful face and sensitive mind who sparkles and twinkles and glistens and shines and who's also almost as dirty as me. That is the end of this video. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.